okay friends so today we are going to talk about this power supply uh, it's really a server power supply used in data centers um, it puts out 12 volts at a pretty good amperage uh, which is like 12 volts at almost 40 amperes or something uh, much higher than what we need in our HF or VHF rigs so we are going to try and use this in our HF amplifier so that we can power it at a cheap so this supply is a model of HP named HSTNS if you see here PL14 so there are multiple uh, models around this numbering that is in the market and these cost about um, 12 to 15 dollars on eBay if you search for them. So they're pretty cheap for uh, what they do and I believe they are uh, good quality because you're not going to use a lot of um, current out of them and because they are made for use with uh, servers that, that run 24 by 7, 365 days uh, in comparison with our uh, ham radio equipment we are just going to use at uh, a very minuscule time. So um, they're good with efficiency as well, uh, more than 85%, I guess so yeah it's it's good power on the cheap and they are uh i believe they're rated a uh, good on uh some of the factors like uh, radio interference and noise etc so yeah that's about it let's let's try and see how we can uh, power it and use it for our hf uh, amplifiers or or 100 watt um, rigs or whatever high power rigs that we have uh, let's go okay so to power this uh, okay let me zoom out a little and if you just power it with a cord like that directly it, it doesn't put out any power uh, while the, I, I see uh, some noise from the fan inside here it's it's not going to put out any power out of it directly unless you short a couple of pins um, at the, the front PCB of this uh, device there are two little pins that you just need to short and then it turns on and starts putting out some power yeah so there's no power out of it what you really need to do is there are some pins here if you see uh, so you need to short couple of these pins the first one which is marked as 33 here and the shorter pin here I'll try to bring it closer so this 33 number pin the first one and the one pin that is a little shorter than the others which is the 36 pin you need to short this and it will turn on and I'm going to try to do that with a, a little switch that I have here. I'm going to try and solder that uh, across these two pins and see if, it, if I'm able to turn it on and how it goes. So, yeah, let me solder this one and let me come back to you guys and see how it goes. All right. okay so i'm done with putting the switch together if you see here's the switch and it's connected to the first one and the little one right here 
this one and this one so I'm hoping that when I turn this on both these pins get shorted and the power supply will start and this will break the connection and put it off so let's see if we have succeeded in doing that so okay so it is connected i can hear the noise of the fan rotating in this one right now the switch is off there is a little led here green one which is not on at the moment so i am not sure if you can see the altimeter so there's no power out of it i'm gonna put it on now the switch is on you can see this light here it has turned on the green one and there you go we have 12 volts of power out of it and i don't know if you can see it here it says 12 volt at 38.3 ampere so this can put a continuous 38 amps out of this power supply you can use it for anything uh, but i mean cryptocurrency mining rigs or amplifiers or anything anything that requires uh, this kind of power 35 38 amps so yeah there it is it's giving us 12 volts you put it off led is gone you're back to zero put it on again led is on we're back to 12 volts so i now plan to drill a couple of holes on each of these positive and negative terminals and maybe put up a couple of binding posts here so that i can use this to um, connect to my uh, amateur radio rigs um, that i intend to use this power supply with uh, so two holes here two holes here a couple of black and red binding posts will help me use this power supply as a bench supply for my um hf rigs so yeah that's that's about it um hope you like this video so please subscribe and like it thank you